So this young lady has just uh, completed a breast augmentation. Uh, you can see the incisions for her were placed in the inframammary fold. Normally I'll have a small steri strip on top. Uh, on occasion I'll place a tegaderm, which is a waterproof dressing on top so that she can shower, bathe herself normally. It's just important not to put the shower head directly on the operative incision, rather away from it. It's okay if soapy water goes onto the wound. Just make sure after the shower you pat the area dry. A surgical bra is worn normally with a zipper in the front or a clasp system in the front and you can put a little bit of extra padding as needed um, in the bra uh, just to make sure that there's not too much uh, irritation uh, after surgery. But it's important to be wearing a surgical bra that zips in the front. Breast massage is also very important. Normally we institute that at about one week after surgery. There are uh, breast displacement exercises which I or one of my nurses will go over with you. It's important to manipulate the breast so it feels and it becomes uh, more attached to the surrounding pocket. So you alternately um, massage the breast in a downward direction and a medial direction. You do that for about five to 10 minutes, two to three times every single day. You can do that in the shower, you can do that post-operatively at home, you can do it when you have the surgical bra on. But it's important to allow for the breast implant to fall into the proper position that has been surgically created for that implant. If there are any questions, feel free to call myself or my office staff, my nurses and myself. We're available 24 hours a day, seven days a week, either through email, through Instagram, or through the phone. We do our best to respond as rapidly and as quickly as possible to any and each of your concerns.